Hello everybody, I'm Evil Rabbit. So if you guys have been following for a while, you guys know I have a handful of wheelbases and wheels. And trying to change up wheels and doing different things on my chassis, undoing it and everything like that can kind of somewhat be of a pain sometimes to undo it, just to change wheelbases for different stuff that I'm doing. Well, Next Level Racing's new GT Lite Pro is gonna help with that. So with it getting fully set up, it was very simple to set up. And as you can see, the reason this is going to be super awesome in my setup purposes is the utilization of being able to collapse it, pull it out, put a rig on here and utilize my monitor that's on my desk by pulling it forward and having a collapsible secondary rig to save myself some space for testing other wheelbases and stuff like that. So we got to get a wheelbase put on this and we're going to go full send. So we do have our Moza R5 and our FSR wheel on there and our Moza pedals. So you can see being able to utilize this underneath, ignore my cables, and utilize the monitor that's on my desk while not fully taking apart my main chassis is something that's going to be awesome for wheel testing. And of course, the hinging of the wheel bracket is nice for getting in and out we do have a shifter plate on there but we don't have a shifter on it yet so we can just easily undo that and do it so it's super awesome for space saving so we're gonna go full send on this and uh, give it a full rip test so with this hinging bit of the next level you know GT light this thing is super Nice to be able to get in and out without having to move anything and things like that. So we do have the Moza R5 on here and it, there's a little bit of play when I do this 
but I don't think it's going to be doing that. This wheelbase is rated for, I believe, 13 newton meters worth of force. So this is definitely super compact, super nice. We do have one more stability strap that we got to put in real quick, which is just the pin into the top piece. And we'll get that lined up and through like so. Clip it back on. And now we got our stability straps for our pedals. And we got our one on the side as well. So the hinging in and out is nice. We do have the shifter plate over here, but we just have the my mouse on there now because we're only running twin pedals. But we are on a Nordschleifen ring in a Porsche. So let's go full send and actually give this rig a shakedown because the comfortability of this thing is super nice being a flexible seat and everything i thought it was going to be you know, not as comfortable it really is but this thing is super comfortable and we are on like i said a five newton meter wheelbase but it is rated for a much higher newton meters with a force but the fact that this is super compact and i can do what i'm doing right now without taking apart my main chassis is the biggest thing for me being able to utilize other wheelbases for testing and stuff like that with my monitor that's currently on my desk and not having to take apart my main chassis is super nice and the ability to do basically hardware testing on another rig that is very very solid and super nice and comfortable is great to have a you know a second rig that I can just fold away and roll kind of out of the way um, and pull out when I need to use it so next level racing with this chassis is definitely uh, amazing. It was really simple to set up with the dials on the sides in order to fold it all together and everything like that. And it's uh, handling this quite well. We are on full force feedback and everything and I'm not noticing much play in the chassis. So I've, I've had a few chassis before and I love my main next level chassis because that thing is just a rock. And for a collapsible chassis, I'm super impressed with the ergonomics of it, how solid it is and how it feels. And, you know, like I said in the beginning, me being able to utilize all my other wheelbases and stuff in this aspect without having to take apart my main chassis is a big win in my books for this. And that's when Next Level was asking me about this. I was like, dude, this is going to be awesome for me to do sim hardware testing and stuff like that off of my main chassis and leave my main chassis alone without having to tear it completely apart. I'm not really focusing too much on driving. We're talking all about this chassis because that's what this is all about. I can't get over how comfortable this actual seat is with the mesh on the back for breathing and of course all the you know finite details that you'd expect from a next level uh, brand item. You know, all the nice stitching straps with all the logos and everything on it. And the positioning and the adjustability for the pedals is just like on my main one. There's four little spin tabs and those, you know, will just auto allow your pedals to slide in and out. We're going to die. Oh, oh, wow. Um, well, I can tell you crashing does not shake this thing loose. But we definitely have a cracked windshield. I didn't know that this windshield cracked this much on this car. I don't know how I'm going to be able to see. So overall, a big thank you to Next Level Chat Racing for this new chassis and the you know simplistic design of folding it in, getting it together and stuff like that and being able to fold it and move it out of the way is definitely a huge plus for me when I'm using other sim bases, uh, wheel bases and stuff like that for testing purposes. Like I said, can't thank them enough. This is an awesome chassis. Even if you wanted to use it as a main chassis, if you're in like an apartment situation or a place where you need to be able to roll it out of the way or a bedroom or anything like that, this would be a very good, solid chassis for you. This window is really messing with me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this a little look at the new chassis. We're gonna be going full send with this in some future episodes and stuff like that with some new hardware testing, sim hardware testing and stuff like that. As well as of course, we're probably going to be throwing this thing around for drifting with some you know handbrakes and shifters and everything on the shifter plate to give that a full test as well 
So make sure you guys follow me on all social media. <laughs> all of which found description box below. I went to go jam into a clutch. <laughs> make sure you check out all the links for the giveaway and everything that Next Level is also doing. You know, you can get a chance to win some cool Next Level products yourself. All of which is in the description box below. So as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.